Hello, this is a brief video tutorial on associating your .sgu and your .mgu files with the Banana Box program on Windows. So as you can see here, I have this .sgu file and it's not currently associated with Banana Box. So it doesn't have the little Banana Box logo here. Um, yours might look very similar. So whenever you click on that, uh, if it doesn't have that little band in a box logo, it's going to open with a different program or it'll prompt you to select a program to open it with. Um, to get this to open with band in a box, what we're going to do is we're going to right click on this .sgu file. And we're going to have some options here. We're going to look for open with. And once we hover our cursor over that, we'll get some more options. And what we're going to select is choose another app. So we're going to left click on that. And that'll open this next window. Now for most people, uh, if this is the first time that they're doing this, uh, the Ban in a Box uh, program won't be able to be selected from this list. And that's fine. If it is, great. You'll go ahead and select it. And then you'll select always use this app to open .sgu files or .mgu files depending on what you've selected. But again, most people won't see that option here. So what you'll do is select more apps and that will expand the list. You'll scroll down and let's say we still didn't find it in this expanded list. We're going to go ahead and select uh, or ensure that always use this app to open .sgu files is selected and we're going to select look for another app on this PC. Now, depending on where you have Ban in a Box installed, whether it's on your internal hard drive of your computer or it's on an external drive, this is, uh, this is where it might differ for you, um, but not by too much. So if you have Ban in a Box installed on your computer's internal hard drive, you're going to go ahead and select Windows C. Uh, in my case, I have it installed on an external drive which is this ultra pack e drive so i'm going to go ahead and select that regardless of which drive you currently have banner box installed on uh, you will have a folder labeled bb you're going to look for that double click on it and once in that folder you're going to go ahead and scroll down until you find either the bbw.exe or the bbw64.exe. I'm going to go ahead and click on bbw64.exe. You see it put it down here in file name. Now I'm going to select open. And as you can see, it, my SGU file now has the little band in a box logo on it. And for you, it will likely also open up the band in a box program. So that's how you associate the .sgu and .mgu files uh, with Banana Box. I hope it was helpful.